Don't you find it wrong? Like, you know, we be forced to be enslaved to do things that we don't really like to do, like bills and tats, and be enslaved to do things that don't raise our mind, heart, and soul, and creativity, and stuff like that. That think about waking up, repeating, doing a job at a mall or some shit like that, right? Why you might be, you, you, you just doing everything in, in, in the Hollywood industry, the military, any type of industry, just repeating, repeating, repeating. Like, if you're going to repeat something, you might as well repeat something that, you know, you love to do. Like, with music, like me, every time I do music, I always have something creative because it pushes my mind, my heart, and soul. You know what I'm saying? I like to do things that make me go beyond. This society that we live in, these higher levels don't want people to go beyond. They want them to be stuck and be average and be slave in the mental and physical, being blinded by money. You know what I'm saying? It's real sad. It's real sad. Like, you know, it's really it's really time for a lot of people to get revolutionary. You know what I'm saying? And I even told people that you don't got to put on a costume to appear to to look like you appear like you represent what you know. You know what I'm saying? And thing is about these society companies, every time you apply for a company, like you sign a deal to a company, they make you put on a facade or put on a mask to you know, make you be one of them. Like, you can't even be yourself. Like, you be a, a control puppet. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't put on no facade and put on a mask. Like, if a company can't let me be me, I don't need that company. That's why I don't put love in these companies. Like, when you put your support and care into a company, most of these industries going to fuck you over and make you look dumb. Yeah, thank you. And check this out. Like the thing is, you notice how when you notice how when pastors at religion churches tend to uh you know preach whatever, and then most of the time, you notice how nobody never really interrupts them and stuff like that. But like you take a person who detached themselves away from society, and they tend to really, 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 really stand up and like you know take action to speak out for those who are afraid to speak you know they the ones who get like interrupted real quick like soon as they're about to say something real important that most people may have thought of but be afraid to say or probably never thought of that's just the type of that's the type of planet earth we live in like it's really sad like it really is you know what i'm saying i've noticed like you know even when i was going to school i've noticed a lot of people put on a facade when I'm at a store, I know it's a lot of employees and put put on a facade, especially the females, right? You know how female employees they put on a facade at a company, but then when when they clock out, they're a totally different person. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, the military, a lot of folks put on a facade. I'm not fooled. Them politicians, they put on a facade. Man, like, you know, all industries put on a facade, you know what I'm saying? They try to, like, play people. They play everybody. Mock people. Tell you to go vote like, you, like you're going to be free and you still, like, you know, slaving at a dead-end job while the Crown Cancel 13, the richest family race in, like, you know, the, the Baphomet society is, like, having money on top of money and everyone just slaving. Like, the thing is, most companies, like, you know, society, they they put it on people to never express what you really think and feel. Because, like, when you detach yourself away from society, you realize that, you know, the life that you was living is basically a lifestyle instead of a lifestyle that the higher-ups want people to live. Try to control people, you know, a life pattern. Like, if someone wants to, like, pursue their craft and, like, you know... And forming unity, like here's the thing, you know what I'm saying? You know, see all the higher ups work together, but like people that's in depth in labor, they don't want to work together. They just want to go their own separate paths and think that you know the money's gonna solve everything, right? And that's a dang lie. And that's a lie right there. I mean, a lot of people do see this, but they they're afraid to take action against it. Like, there is no reason to be afraid of the higher-ups, man. Like, folks, man, like, if folks really knew that the God of Most High, you know, and 
the multiverse like of past present and future heroic spirits is like within them they shouldn't be afraid to take a stand against the higher ups like you know like you take a person like me you know what i'm saying i already told folks age don't matter like you know if you dig deep in from within your spirit when you like really connect the like high vibrations in the spirit you gonna really express what you truly you know discovered from higher dimensions beyond the 3d dimension like what you think and feel against the society you know what i'm saying this higher up demonic society that's why the multiverse is trying to shift negative vibes away like the sooner people will like the sooner people can use their light and erase this negative vibes from society like you know being enslaved because let me tell you something most folks don't really think they're in slavery because of the money that they you know earn the money that they earn that's not really theirs from you know these higher ups and then higher ups like you know take a lot of they take like what a thousand percent out from like what you could really have and it might take you 20 years to be in retirement and, and and be comfy, right? Like that's just wrong. That's just total wrong. Like you gotta have so much hate to enslave people to do dirty work and have your own greed. That's what these Baphomet Crown Cancel Thirteen guys just do to people. Like this is the type of conversations that a lot of people need to really have, like on a daily basis. You know, just detach yourself away from society. You do that, you'll be surprised at how many solutions we can come up with. Because, you know, they always say communication always brings solutions, right? And that's real deep, ice cold, savage detail talk right there for the mind, heart, and soul. So a lot of us people on earth can come up with solutions to actually break free from this matrix that we live in. And like, you know, overcome these higher ups that have been working together to enslave us. And, and keep us like in chain mental and physical slavery and be blinded by a lot of lies with all this money and shit that is really artificial that doesn't mean a thing to the god of most high in like multiverse of spiritual vibrations we can like really bring positive light to the multiverse and everything is is gonna go on a, on a fluid pace and negativity will be erased because me for one thing for sure I show I show no love to none of these industries where it might be the military, the religion, the school, the politician, Hollywood, you know, nine to five. I show no love to none of those corporations ran by the Crown Council 13. I really don't because they screw people over. And like me, I just can't ever like be at a cash register again a day in my life. You know what I'm saying? You know, hell, Fred's. Like you know, Fred's uh dollar, Fred's like dollar store and shit like that. That shit was ass. Like I used to work there, you know what I'm saying. I could never like you know express how I really feel and think at shitty ass ministers. Um, and me, I could never work at the mall and shit. You know what I'm saying. Like you know, repeating, waking up and like you know pushing uh, you know carts and shit like just for people to use and stuff like that. And like you know, I and I don't get to like you know holler at no chicks and shit like that and not show my potential through my music. You know, that's just a real deep, ice-cold, savage talk, like, right there, man. Like, it's deep. That's just something I had to, like, really share and everything. You know, let it all out. Because this is something that goes on in my mind, heart, and soul every day, ever since I detached myself away from this Baphomet Illuminati society. I don't want to see none of my humans... Be a slave to these Baphomet Crown Cancel 13 higher ups anymore. It's not gonna happen no more. We will form a unity if we just have communication and form a solution to break free from this matrix. Because our craft of the things that we are good at is something that is instilled in us from our spiritual vibrations to use to make the multiverse go around so no other generations gotta suffer no more. You know what I'm saying? It's all about freedom and doing things you love to do.